Hello everybody and welcome back to another video. Today is gonna be amazing because I get to tell you about my new game coming out in two days. Wednesday, Thursday, two days. It comes out on Thursday, the 3rd of November. I am super pumped. We've been working on this game for about four or five months now and I haven't told you guys hardly anything about it. So today is gonna be the video where I'm just gonna absolutely bombard you with information, tell you all about it. I'm gonna show you screenshots, gameplay, stuff like that. Uh, and just get you super hyped, it, super ready, and uh, it's going to be awesome, it's going to be really good. Just before we get started, there's also going to be a link in the description, which will link you to the Keepy Ducky Twitter, which, there's already gameplay on there, there's already screenshots of the game, if you don't know about it. Um, and yeah, if you want to go follow that, that'd be cool. Uh, that's basically going to be the main sort of hub for like information about the game, if there's updates, if something goes wrong or whatever. Uh, fingers crossed, hopefully it doesn't, but <laughs> yeah, that's going to be the main sort of sector. For, for everything Keepy Ducky related. So yeah, if you want to go follow there, then do that. That's awesome. Uh, if not, yeah, let's just, just just crack on. Let's just do it. So let's talk about it. How did, how, what is it? How did it get started? How did Keepy Ducky get started? So Keepy Ducky started uh, roughly around two years ago. Me and Stamps was in the quest world and we kind of came up with a mini game, uh, which was very, very simple. We wanted to basically uh, do a Keepy Ducky game, which was trying to keep little ducks in the air uh, with snowballs for as long as possible. And it was sort of timed. And then when they fell to the floor, the game was over. And yeah, we kind of did that. Oh, we got one. We got one. Come on. Come on. It's oh, oh. Oh, he doesn't uh, seem very uh, happy. That was pretty much it. Two years went by, and then at the start of this year, uh, I really wanted to actually make my own sort of game. Uh, so that's what I decided to do. I was playing around with a few ideas, and that was the main sort of thing that I really stuck with because it just felt like a really fun sort of idea to go with. So that was the main sort of reason why I picked Keeper Doggy because I just really just liked it. So yeah, and the game isn't just what you saw on Quest. We have developed it so much more. Uh, it's a really sort of awesome, fun, high score, and who can get the highest score um, addictive game. So let's get on to it. So the main objective of the game is for you to try and get the highest score by keeping the ducks in the air for as long as possible. Now there's not just one duck, as you spawn in the level, more and more ducks spawn in over time, making it harder for you to actually keep them all in the air at once. You have to get the ammo by swiping left and right on the screen uh, to keep your ammo replenished on the left hand side of the screen. It gets very, very hard over time. You get a higher score as you hit the ducks and you know it kind of progresses like that. Uh, there's three levels, so there's an easy level for people that are just a keepy ducky, you know, beginner sort of like that. There's a medium level, which is a little bit harder, so the ducks fall in faster, there's more ducks, uh, they're spawning quicker, and uh, also uh, the ammo doesn't actually spawn in as quick as the beginning level. So that's kind of like for people that are, are more sort of, you know, they're feeling a bit confident. Uh, there's also a hard level, which is the ducks are a lot smaller, they spawn in four at a time. It's very, very fast, the ammo is you have to be very careful with the ammo. You can't just like spam the screen, otherwise you run out of ammo, and you know you're just gonna you're just gonna fail. That's it. That's pretty much it. Now you're not on your own in the game. There is also pets to help you. I really love pets. I have lots of pets myself, so I really wanted to include pets to help you on your adventure to become the Keepy Ducky Master. So there's lots of different pets. There's dogs, there's cats, there's even a turtle at the moment. There's gonna be uh, some more updates where we introduce more pets, but the pets are not just pets. They are pets with abilities, four abilities to be exact. So we have got a bounce ability, which is if the ducks are falling and you cannot reach one of them, then your pet will basically go over and bounce the duck back in the air uh, so you, the game isn't over, just to help you out. There's the gather ability, which when you unlock that, if you click it, your pet will then go scavenge ammo and coins for you. So you don't have to. You could just sit there, tapping on the screen, keeping them ducks in the air, not having to worry about picking up that ammo or the coins. That is a really cool ability. The next one is probably my favorite. It's called the fart or the poop ability. So what this is going to do is when you press it, there's going to be a big fart cloud that comes on screen, pushing all the ducks all the way up to the top. It's kind of like a reset button. Once you press it, you don't really have to worry. You have like three or four seconds to go collect ammo to kind of reset yourself. Um, and yeah, it, it, it stinks. But it's good. And the fourth ability is the top. That is when you have leveled up your pet so much that they are just an absolute master at keeping ducky. And they will help you by throwing snowballs themselves for around 20, 30 seconds. And they will just, it's just like another player in the game. They will literally be by your side, just 
spamming snowballs at the duck. So these are the four abilities. Once you've unlocked them all, you can use them all in the game. And uh, yeah, it's that, you can just level them up. That's how you get the abilities. Level up your pets, you get more abilities. That's as simple as that. And one of the cool things that we've done with the game is actually having character customization. So what you're going to do, you when you play in the game, you're going to earn coins. Coins will actually fall from the ducks. You pick them coins up. You can go over to the little gift section and you can buy yourself a pack. And when that pack opens, there'll be a random card inside, whether it be new pets or new clothes and stuff like that. So you can basically dress your character how you like them. Uh, there's YouTubers in the game, so you can go and play as your favorite YouTuber if you can unlock all their sort of different sort of clothing items and faces and stuff like that. It sounds a bit weird, but it's really, really cool. So there's a lot of customization in there for you guys to play around with. One of my favorite things as well is, you know, you want to kind of challenge each other. There is a leaderboard feature. So say if I get like 800 score, but you have more, you're going to be higher on the leaderboard. You can see it. There's uh, a re obviously like a real time. It gets updated uh, as people get a higher score. So you can see who is the best in the world at Keep It Up. Yeah? It's a challenge for you guys to beat them and show off your skills. So I'm super excited. For I'm going to. I'm, I'm excited. I'm excited. And hopefully, I'm still going to be the top of the leaderboard. But once you get the game, you can play. You can try and challenge me, and you can try and beat my high score. But I doubt it. Don't be upset if you don't beat it. Okay. But yeah, it's really been such a such a good thing to work on. As I say, it this has been I've been working on this with my game developers for about four or five months now. Every single day, I've been helping them out, putting my ideas forth, giving them feedback. We've been working on it together for a long time. So I'm hoping that you guys enjoy it. The game is free, so everybody can enjoy it. Um, I'm just I'm just super excited. So yeah, tell your friends, tell everybody, go download it, go play it. I'm gonna be doing a challenge when it comes out with probably Ash. If you guys want to do it too, then uh, yeah, this is the Keepy Ducky Challenge. So what is the Keepy Ducky Challenge, you ask? Well, you have to basically challenge a friend to a game of Keepy Ducky. One game you both will play and whoever gets the highest score will then choose the loser's score, a forfeit. The loser's score? The play with the least score, a forfeit. So pretty much if I play Ash, and he gets the lowest score, I've got to challenge him to do a random forfeit. And it isn't going to be pleasant. Nope. I think I might do, like, eat some raw eggs. I don't know. What, sh what should we do? Leave some comments in the suggestions if I beat him, what we should do. But, yeah. If you want to do that, that's going to be good. You can, like, post your, like, videos on, like, Twitter or whatever using the hashtag KeepyDuckyChallenge. Uh, and show me what you and your friends have done. Who's got the highest score? Who got the worst forfeit? It's going to be fun. It's going to be great. I'm going to be super, super excited. But yeah, I think I've covered everything in the video. Uh, if you guys have got any questions, then I'm going to be actually answering some of your questions in the comment section below. If you head over to the Twitter page now, go give it a follow, go check it out. I'm going to leave it on screen now. It is at Keepy Ducky Game. And, uh, and yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll reply to people over there. i talk to people over there. There's also some screenshots if I didn't show them all in this video. Um, but yeah, comes out on the 3rd of November. Thursday, guys, right in your diary. Go download it. It's going to be fun. It's going to be a, an absolute blast. The game is amazing fun. There's a lot to unlock. There's a lot to play. Um, and I love competition and, like, getting the highest score. And then that's what the game really focuses on. Just who can be the best? Who is the best at the game? So, yeah, my name's been Squidoodle, guys. Hope you have enjoyed. And, yeah, Thursday. Let's make this amazing. It's going to be awesome. So thanks for watching. I'll see you then. Bye.